Hello there. Well, what is it? It is something fun. I think, maybe. I'm adjusting volumes that I should have done beforehand, but that is okay. I have this big tangled mess of uh, cables all over my desk, so that way I can directly monitor myself, because that shit is fun. Directly monitoring. So much fun. But yeah, so we, I guess, are going to go to the depths. Is there anything I really want to do beforehand, though, before I start wandering too far? I think maybe I might... Now that I have a little bit of money, I might run and go do... I might do the, uh... I might go grab the other Smith Boxy thingies. Damn it. I All I want is the parry. That is literally it. That is all I want with my life. Is to parry things great. And also, I... I do think still I'm going to stick with this lovely... Nope. Damn it. I do think I am going to stick with this lovely weapon. Actually, am I going... Because... No, I, sh I should go the other way. Whoopsies. Not a smart one I am. Yeah, and last time we pretty much talked to everybody, so I don't think that there's going to be any problems, and we can now just go and do things and fun stuff. Alright, so they already left then, huh? So I guess whenever you talk to them, slash whenever the world is in that kind of state, and you quit your game, and or bonfire it up, or something, they leave. Which is pretty cool. But yeah, just because I have the money, you know, I can do things. And then we can run back here and do more things. Things. I like the things. The things are fun. And of course now probably everybody and their grandmothers are all following me. Ooh, only one brave soldier here. Nope. Come on. Boom, gotcha. For real, I love it. <laughs> oh, that is definitely one of my... I don't know, it's just... It's, it's hard enough that when you do it, it's so satisfying. And I might, I might have some souls as well. Just so that way I can do all of this stuff without having to come here well, back here. And because I don't even have enough souls right now, so... Or I don't have enough souls to really do anything. Okay, so now I have pretty much everything. But trust me, I don't want to see myself go hollow either. Oh yeah, I totally forgot I have 10 large Titanite shards as well. So do I have any soulsies that I can use? I do. Because I might just upgrade my weapon just a tiny little bit more for the upcoming joiny. And of course they're not in my damn bar. So I gotta go back in here. Actually shit, I shouldn't have done that. Whoopsies. Reinforced weapon. Because I also do like this sword. I think it's a pretty cool sword. Oh, I guess I can't do it after then, huh? Okay, well that's shitty, I guess. Yeah, so let me see what the deal is then. So I guess I can only do it up to a certain point. Up to plus five. Regularly. 
Well, I don't you need No, how do I do this then? Okay, I'm confused. Is that technically ascending it though, or is that just reinforcing it still? Alright, whatever, it'll be fine. Don't get yourself killed. I can only try, my friend, I can only try. <laughs> and it's probably not gonna go well for me, but thank you for your concern anyway, my dear friend. But okay, so pretty much I think I'm fucked. So now I need to make my way all the way back to Firelink. But yeah, so I guess I guess it is. I I didn't know that, but you learn new things every day. Oh, I wanted the backstab. Now I will get this parry because oh no, maybe I won't. Please, please let me get the parry. Please. You. Nope. Whatever. It'll be okay. I'm really surprised that none of those guys follow me. Or maybe there are perma dead. I don't know. I honestly don't even want to take a look. Because I feel like if I even look that way... Because I'm assuming that the fact that they dropped the balder side sword... Yay! Oh, wait, what the fuck? Was I... Uh, uh, whoa, okie dokie then. Or never mind, this is it right here. For a second I was like, oh no, did I find something cool and secret and shit? But no, I didn't. I do know that there is some other stuff I can do around here, but... Oh, that was fucking stupid. That was not smart. But it'll be okay. I guess, maybe, possibly. I love how our little community here is starting to growl. It's so cute. Mr. Crestfallen Negative Nancy. We got the guy who got trapped by a wooden door. We got the dude who's almost certainly definitely not evil. Come on. Nope. Please? Whatever. It'll be okay. But yeah, I am kind of a little bit bummed that I cannot... Ooh, yeah, there we go. That is my shit right there. Ooh. No, I wanted another one. I'm getting really greedy with the backstabs. Of course, I'm always greedy in Dark Souls. I feel like it's very hard to to not be at least a little bit greedy in Dark Souls, you know? Like, the second you see something, like, you pull off and it's awesome and yeah, like, no, you, like, you want more. That's how it normally goes. Maybe I'll actually try a plunging attack this time. Haha, -ha, and I got him, but I also drained a little bit of my health. I don't remember if I did that. I think I did this on camera. I think I like took a poke in here. Or maybe not. I don't know. Since I got all my new... Uh, I got a whole bunch of new audio equipment. Um, as well as... I, I might have said it before. I have something called a Personas Monitor Station. And it's normally meant to do the job of a mixer on the output levels. Like if you have like a regular interface and not like a really cool mixer. It's meant to kind of... I knew it, but it's kind of meant to allow you to have different outputs and inputs and all this kind of stuff. It's really cool. I really, really like it, and I've been using it now. So I've been doing a lot of tests. Yeah. So I don't remember if I opened that door on camera or not, but I pretty much, if I didn't, I looked in and went, nah, 
F that and walked away. What does that sound? Large soul of a nameless soldier. I'm curious as to where some of these illusory walls are. Because everybody keeps talking about them, but they're nowhere to be found. Oh, God, no. Who is getting angry at me? Oh, it's that guy. But he's a dummy, so he's obviously not even aiming correctly at me. Damn it, that was stupid. I love that R2, it's so good. R2 OP, any button OP. For anybody who's been playing the Street Fighter beta. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and do this really quickly. Because it would be my luck to die. Hey, sometimes you can't... Oh! Sometimes you cannot underestimate your... Or, yeah. Underestimate your enemy. Even these little guys. So, yeah. This is another thing that I really like that this game does. And that you kind of get to see some of your enemies ahead of time. Whoa! Uh-uh, 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 uh-uh. Where are you going? I, I can hear footsteps. Also, isn't that Butcher a lady? If that, if that Butcher comes out of nowhere and murders me, I'm going to be super upset. Yeah, I'm trying to be really careful in here. Because I have no idea what is even going on. No! All I wanted was a backstab, and she wouldn't give it to me. <laughs> okay, so... I don't even... I, I want to find it before... It, her... Because... I don't know if it's speculation or not. I think it was actually mentioned, or something. Somewhere, I don't know. Remember, noob, noob souls here. I just don't want to even... I really don't want to fuck with it. I mean, I'm sure it would be easy to, like, probably backstab and stuff, but. Oh, there we go. Okay, actually, really quickly, do I have any bolts left? I think I might. Didn't I buy some from somebody or something? Also, I should probably at some point get the damn. Uh, actually, so I really want to figure something out, and this is going to sound really noobish, and I'm really sorry for it, but can you go into first-person mode with a crossbow? I do not believe so. Nah, I'm just punching stuff. So angry. Urg. Mosh pit over here, guys. Watch out. We got a cool kid. Okay. So, pretty much regardless, I'm screwed then. <laughs> that's the... Uh, that seems to be the consensus here. Okay, you know what? Screw it. Let's do this. Where, where did I say she was again? I'm going to call it a she because I think it's a she. Oh, there totally is stairs over here. Come on, doggy. Come on. Yeah, because that's the main thing that I was scared about is the dogs that are over here. Oh, there we go. You're going to follow me up here? Come on. Damn, that was close. Can I see, should I see if I can parry it? That move looks so familiar. From Buttborn. 
Okay, can I do the backstabs? Yes, I can do the backstabs. And it feels just as good. Alright, so now I'm gonna do... Oh, shit. Damn, that was some heavy hitting nonsense there. Come on. There we go. Now you're dead. GG. GG, Butcher Lady. GG. 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 I know there's another doggy around here. Come on, doggy. Never mind, doggy. Oh, large ember. Oh, ew. is that what I need? I think that's what I need. Let's take a look at it really quickly, because why not in the middle of a place that's probably going to kill us? Ember required for weapon ascension. A large, high-quality ember handled by the blacksmiths of Astora. God damn, everything's from Astora. Ascension for plus five standard weapon allows reinforcement to plus... Okay, yeah, so that answers my question exactly. Also can ascend to plus five standard weapon to raw weapon. Oh, so, okay, that completely answered my question. And I'm not worried now. That looks like a place that I don't want to go. I do want to check something out really quickly because this looks different over here. Here, hang on one second. Oh, damn it. Of course, it's my, uh... I'm using an RCA cable to connect my, uh... Ah! I swear to God, that was completely legitimate. I really screamed like that. Oh, my God. Never mind. Later, guys. Holy shit. Yeah, F you. That was fucking terrifying. Okay, coolie, I got it. Yay. To now. Please don't tell me that there's another one around here. Soul of a Nameless Soldier. Alright, so I'm going to say no thank you to this area over here. This lovely, lovely area filled with like likes and all that fun, nonsensical junk. So I'm going to actually go around over here and just see what else is over here, basically. Damn. No, I thought I got it. Come on. And the butt stab. Okay, so I guess some enemies have a thingy. No, damn it. Damn it again. There we go. So something that really interests me, I'm going to go ahead and mention it because uh, I don't really have any sort of, I guess for lack of a better word, I'll say forum for me to discuss it because I don't, I, I would love to make a, you, yes, you, here, over me, please, you must help me. Okay, so first we get a guy who's stuck behind a wooden door, and now we get a guy who's stuck in a barrel. Thank you. I would have been a supper without you. Been eaten alive, I started to think. Thank you. Thank you dearly. I am Luensius. Or the Great Swamp. I will not forget my debt to you. Oh, hello there. I'm fine, thanks to you. Oh, hello there. I'm fine, thank 
So is he gonna pick up and move know. then, or...? Yeah, because I'm just confused now why he isn't saying anything else. So I'm assuming he's gonna move. And I think that that is... If, if I remember correctly from the little things I do know about the game... He, yeah, yeah, he's got his hand fiery. Oh, he, hello there. He's, he's the uh, pyromancy seller, merchant, whatever. But what I was going to say is, uh, I actually really wanted to make a analysis of the Dark Souls 3 stuff that came out from, like, Gamescom and all that nonsense. But the thing is, I do, to a certain extent, feel as though... Not necessarily that you need to be into it to really talk about it, but I feel like people would have probably looked at me like I was stupid if I had, you know, only played Dark Souls 2 and started talking about Dark Souls 3 like I knew what I was talking about, because there was a lot of interesting stuff in that trailer, and now people have talked about it to great lengths, but, because, you know, I also, this may sound really stupid, but I do feel to a certain extent that, you know... I never want to, you know, disrespect anybody or or any particular fan base. Like, I know a shit ton about Persona. So, I feel like I can talk about that game. But, you know. But what I wanted to say is something that really I'm starting to notice a little bit more and something that I'm really excited for in Dark Souls 3 is that they seem to say a lot of the enemies... Sorry, I'm just trying to make sure I'm not going to get mauled by one of those things again. But, uh... Ooh, there we go. Okay, so there's not one over there. Okay, and I can see them. So what I am going to do is be really cheap. What I was going to say is something that I'm super excited for is the fact that enemies seem to not want to let you get backstabs on them. Which I think is really cool. Because I think that... You know, with a... Because uh, what a lot of people seem to say is that uh, there was a reduced backstab range, or uh, I guess available space for you to get it, and also that the enemies didn't really want to let you get them anyway. Which is something that I find really cool. And it got me really excited because... I like games with smart bad guys. Like, not every game has to have smart enemies and stuff. But... I think that Dark Souls has a very unique position. In that... Yeah, so those guys want to drop down on me, but I don't want to let them. There we go. That is what I wanted to get them to do. Oh, shit. Come on with this bullshit. Because I also don't know what their regular attacks look like. But I think that Dark Souls is in a very unique position in that I think that they have the greatest platform to have enemies that are just so much smarter than you. And a lot of, like, you know, the regular hollows and stuff are not. <laughs> they're, they're dumb. And I think what's really cool is, you know, if, if, if you're trying to trail around an enemy and he's, like, uh, kicking you and shield bashing you if you try to go around him, I think that that's something that could be super interesting. And it's going to make the game harder. You know? Because realistically, if you, if you have to be afraid of getting screwed up every time you go for a backstab, like, you're obviously going to fight more fair. You know? I don't know. I'm just very, very excited for that game. And as I said, I, I don't want to make videos just about it because... I have no idea what I'm talking about, realistically, and um, something that, like, immediately when I got my hands on this game, and something that interests me is that a lot of people say, you know, it feels like Dark Souls 1, 
but better, I guess, or faster, or whatever. People use different phrasing for it. Did I kill all of them? I think I did. Yay, we killed them. But yeah, so... Something that I noticed that immediately when I got my hands on... On specifically Dark Souls 1... Ooh, a bonfire. Is that I love the mechanics of this game. Like, the way this game feels way more... I'm confused. I think something weird is going on here. Oh shit, I shouldn't have done that. God damn it. That's fine, I guess. I'm just confused because... Because, like, look at that. But also, I don't know if you can hear it, but... It sounds like something is going on. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Something just weird seems to be going on here. Like, I can hear somebody speak, or, like, if it sounds like, for lack of a better word, it sounds like a woman kind of, like, uh, whimpering. Okay, so now I'm going to poke my head up just to make sure I'm not going to die doing this. Oh, my God, what is that? Um, I would really rather not climb down there because that is a rat of very unusual size. Sorry, I probably clipped there, but Jesus Christ, that thing looked scary. That is also a lot of rats. Just trying to make sure that... Okay, there's one of those things. Come on, follow me. Damn. Well, at least I got him. Silly bunny. Tricks are for kids. Is that how it went? I forget. I'm also old. I'm too old for this shit. Yeah, now come on back this way. Everybody, a line of death awaits you. And it is great. I promise. Oh, I got a humanity. Humanity. Damn it. There we go. That's what I wanted. Sorry, it sounded like my phone was going off and I was like, eh, that's bad. I don't want to... I don't want to die and have to come back here. Well, actually, the bonfire was right there, so I wouldn't have to wait that far. Or I wouldn't have to travel that far, I mean. What exactly is going on with that thing? I do not know. Great axe. That sounds pretty cool. I like the idea of an axe being great. Okay, so was that nothing then? Ugh... I thought that that was one of those uh, goopy guys, but I guess it isn't. I'm trying to keep... Oh! God damn it. I am such a little baby. 